Hello, I am Dr. Ashwini. I am a fetal medicine specialist and I work at Cloud9 Hospitals, Kanakpura Road. Nuchal translucency scan is a second scan performed in the pregnancy. It is performed in the third month. That is in about 11 to 14 weeks of gestation. So in this scan, what we look for is the measurement of the baby's heartbeat, the length of the baby, to check if the baby has grown appropriately for its age and also we look at the structures of the baby. By third month, the fetus has already developed and the main structures that is the head, the heart, the abdomen, uh, the upper and lower limbs, the spine have already developed and we can actually look at these structures to find if there is any structural problem. The second thing is, we look at the blood supply to the womb. So by looking at this, we can predict if a mother can develop high blood pressure in pregnancy. The third important reason why this is performed is to look for features of chromosomal abnormalities. And Down syndrome is one of the most common chromosomal abnormality with a prevalence of about 1 in 600. And these fetuses have some features, namely increased water at the back of the neck which is increased nuchal translucency and the nasal bone is not properly developed. After performing the scan, we give a risk for Down syndrome. For example, the risk is expressed as 1 in 7000. So what does this mean? This means that if we have 700 pregnant women with similar age, similar scan findings, there is one fetus which can be Down syndrome.